What we have here is a miracle. Hashtag, really? A Catholic congressman is going to boycott the, the, the false prophet, I mean the Pope's speech over climate change. And uh, this guy, again, he's a confessed Catholic. And uh, he says he's a practicing Catholic. His name's Paul Gosser. He's from Arizona. I hope I didn't butcher his name there. I believe that's a picture of him there. We're going to put this article on Hardway Mountain so you guys can read the whole thing. But I thought it was a pretty interesting catch on this news thing because what in the world, I mean, I, you know, one guy boycotting, boycotting a speech, that's not going to change or hurt the Pope's feeling, a false promise. I mean, the cult, that, that guy's feelings, you all know who I'm talking about. I, you guys know I'm joking, too. Uh, I know exactly what his name is. I know his name, Mr. Satan. Mr. False Prophet is his name. Also, you know, he goes by certain other names like Pope and things like that. But anyway, I just thought you guys might like that, and I ramble on. Uh, but yeah, GOP lawmaker vows to boycott Pope's speech to Congress. There he is, man. He, he's going to get disowned by his local church, what he bet. <laughs> he won't let him back in or won't let him crucify Christ every, you know, during service. I mean, take communion. You know, Christ crucified on the Christ once for us. He really did. You know, he did that for every single one of us to have eternal salvation. But yet the Catholic Church, they, they crucify him hundreds of times a day across the world. We crucify him. Why? Why? That's all I can say is why do you do that? All right, Pastor Kelly will quit rambling and babbling and going on. But, I, you know, you guys read that and uh, support the fella and see if you can't bring him on over to our side, you know, the uh, Christian side, and he can leave that cultic church. I mean, if he's going to boycott his boss, then by all means, come and join a Christian church and find the real meaning of God. God bless you all one and all. Pastor Kelly is out of here.